No, it isn't my first visit to St Mary's. Um, last one wasn't too pretty. I actually came, came here in 2014 with Lindenwood University when I was over here studying. Um, we actually made the semi-finals for the D1A comp, which is a big comp over here, and we got dusted 70 odd points to not many odd points. There was actually a sevens team uh, playing at, at Lindenwood, and I didn't even put my hand up for it. Um, and no interest in the game then, but it's funny how things change. And a couple of years down the track, I'm, I'm back here, but in my national national colours. Probably a couple of years ago, I, I wouldn't have even thought I'd be in the team. So to be here at the World Cup is a pretty, pretty surreal experience and, yeah, looking forward to it. To be honest, I'm, I'm happy to play wherever I'm needed. You know, I've been on the wing, been at half, a little bit in the forwards now. So, you know, I just enjoy being on the field and, and helping out wherever I can. While she was running those uh, seven-minute scenario blocks today, um, he calls them his, his teabag moments. Um, we first brought it up over in Singapore, teabag moments. Um, it's, he defines it as um, you put a tea bag in hot water and see what it does, either it dissolves or it holds and you get a great tea out of it. So hopefully this weekend we don't dissolve and we, we uh, produce some good tea. The numbers on the back represent our, our cap numbers, so that, that's been something that's been put together by um, James Sanard and Lewis Holland in the, in the last few months. Um, and it's really quite a special number to us and to have them on the back of our training jersey is pretty, pretty cool. Definitely um, a big chance for us this weekend at AT&T. Um, our, our last tournament in uh, San Francisco was, or San Jose, just down the road we took out. So hopefully we can do the same.